Hi, I'm Angel Delich for Bass City Beat, and today we're here at Mount Clemens Public Library, introducing the first new library director in almost half a century. After 45 years of service, Donald E. Worrell Jr. has retired from his position as Mount Clemens Public Library Director, opening up the door for Brandon Bowman to take over. Formerly at Oak Park, Brandon is looking forward to working with students, starting up new programs, and refreshing some of the old ones. He is enthusiastic and ready to undertake any challenges that may arise. Those are some big shoes to fill. Um, you know, Don was very well liked around here, and uh, as he should be, because he was fantastic to, uh, when I was making my transition here. Um, and uh, the, the big thing for me is that we're, we're very different people, so a lot of the things that um, he did, uh, you know, I will probably do a little bit differently. And that might, you know, um, be problematic at times uh, for some people to, until they get used to me, but um, you know, in a lot of ways our philosophies are very similar. You know, we are very um, both big on the community, uh, bringing the best services that we can and making sure that the library is here to meet the needs of everybody that uh, comes in. So, you know, so there probably won't be a huge difference in, in the way that things are done here. Just uh, it might be a little bit more um, uh, flashy, I guess, maybe that would be a good word for it. Beginning as a youth librarian, Brandon is very happy with Mount Clemens Public Library's children's program, the library's involvement in the community, and the variety of groups involved with the library. He is looking forward to trying to find out what people want from the library and incorporating in technology. He wants to focus on getting young people involved and is excited to try new things. I really like uh, um, working with other organizations within the, wherever I'm at, you know, getting um, looking for those win-win situations where everybody gets something out of it you know either it be you know working with a local business and they get um, free advertising and we get a, a program out of it um, you know those kind of things are huge I like promoting local businesses too you know having people come in and saying you know hey I know I need to go get my drywall fix and I remember this guy came and he showed me how to do something at the library I know he's a carpenter I'm gonna give him a call and so it's uh, those kind of things that really those those little synergies that um, you know make things um, you know, work. Worrell's retirement, as well as that of Assistant Director Debbie Larson, will be a hard loss to the library, but will also provide the chance to start over with a clean slate and bring in some new ideas necessary to moving forward. We'd like to welcome Brandon Bowman to our community and wish him and our library continued success in the future. We're looking forward to some new fun and exciting programs and hope to have him with us for another 45 years. For Bath City Beat, I'm Angel Delich.